Hello guys, in this tutorial we are going to create this. It's page flip logo animation. So without delay let's take action. As usual make new composition. Rename it to page flip logo animation. Set resolution to 1920 by 1080. Set FPS to 25. And set duration to 10 seconds. And add your logo into comp. And scale it just like me. Then pre-compose logo layer, make sure move all attributes into new composition is selected. And rename it to logo comp. Hit OK. Go to effects and presets panel. And search for CC page turn. Drag and drop it onto logo comp. Then move 15 frames forward on timeline. On effects controls tab. Add keyframe on fold radius and fold position. Drag fold position point just like me. And set controls to top right corner. Adjust fold position point just like me. Then set fold radius to 400. Jump forward on 2 seconds on timeline. And set fold radius to 50. And again move fold position point to center. Select logo comp and press U key on keyboard. To see all keyframes. Select all keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor and adjust graph just like me. Go to beginning of timeline. Select logo comp. And press S key on keyboard to see scale property. Add keyframe on it. And set scale to 0%. Move one second forward on timeline. And set scale to 100%. Select all keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Go to Effects and Presets panel and search for Find Edges Effect. And drag it onto Logo Comp. On Effects Controls panel. Set it on Invert. Select Logo Comp Layer. Press Ctrl plus D 4 times to duplicate it 4 times. So there will be 5 Logo Comp Layers. Then move 5 frames forward on Timeline. And move 4th logo comp layer to 5th frame. And move 3rd logo comp layer to 10th frame. 2nd to 15th frame. 1st to 20th frame. Select 5th logo comp layer. Go to effects controls tab. And set blend with original to 20%. Select 4th logo comp and set blend with original to 40%. Select 3rd logo comp and set it to 60%. Select second logo comp and set it to 80%. Select first logo comp and set it to 100%. And our animation will look like this. Set motion blur mode on for all logo comp layers. And composition. Then select all logo comp players and pre compose them. Rename it to animation. 
Hit OK. Make new white solid. And name it BG. Set it below animation comp. Let me decrease logo scale a little bit. Select BG layer. Go to Effects and Presets panel. And search for Gradient Ramp. And add it onto BG layer. On Effects Controls tab set Ramp Shape to Radial Ramp. Set Start Ramp Point to Center. And adjust End of Ramp Point just like me. On Effects Controls panel. Click on Suave Colors. And set end color whatever you desire. I am choosing this. Select animation comp. And press Ctrl plus D to duplicate it. And rename it to shadow. Go to Effects and Preset Panel and search for Fill Effect. And add it on to Shadow Comp. On Effects Controls tab, set Fill Color to Dark Gray. Make Shadow. And Animation Comp to 3D. Select Shadow Comp. And press P key to see Position Property. And adjust Y Position just like me. Then press S key on keyboard to see position property. And remove constraint. And adjust scale Y just like me. And press P key. And again adjust Y position like me. Then go to effects controls tab. And search for Fast Blur. And add it on to Shadow Comp. On Effects Controls tab set Blurriness to 200. Make Fill Color a little bit darker gray. Make new null object. Select shadow. And animation comp. And set pick whip on null object so it will parent them to null object. At beginning of timeline. Press P key on null object. And add keyframe on position property. Move forward to 3 and half second on timeline. Also set null object 3D. And increase C position just like me. And set last keyframe to easy ease in. And here comes our final output.